Hello everybody, my name is Farmer Phil and today as you can see I'm in the umbilical system tractor and I'm about to start rolling up pipes so hold on and I'll get started gloves so the pipe is there, it's down it's not exactly great for rolling up um, I probably have a too, well, I de yeah, I definitely have too much pipe for doing the field and I just can't get it just as nice as I'd like to have it so we'll see how it goes anyways um, I'll roll up this pipe like this and then I might stick the camera up there where the lights are and watch the rest of the pipes being rolled up in fast motion at the end of this so this is what I always do for putting on these pipes you hit and put it on like that because they can be a they can be an absolute disaster to put in where it is there and then start spinning normally it just falls off so that's the pipe there it's going up that way and back down and around there so it's not exactly a desirable way to do it but um it should be okay we'll see how it goes and if any problems arise I'm sure I'll be able to show you how to fix them. So let's get started. So rolling pipe is fairly straightforward, as you can imagine. You just let it go side to side as you're rolling it up. Throttle. Watching my pipe there now as well. I'm expecting a few little twists to come into it, but hopefully now they'll come out when you start pulling when you start pulling the end of the pipe if there's any twists in it it'll normally wind them out at that point especially when I'm rolling up and if the twist comes in it it backs up the pressure there and it helps unravel it so it should should be all right now rolling up is very straightforward you just side to side and you just roll it up like you'd roll up anything nice and neatly or as best as you can so now with the blue pipes that we're using we have, I can't think of the name of the ends that's on them, the clips, I think I think it's snap type but I'm not 100% sure. It's the ones with um, that just are put in and then you slide them around with a spot, like a big spanner. Now with them, now they're, they're great for, for rolling up because you can roll them up from any, there's no, um, ends are all the same so you can roll it up from either end whereas with the old bower clips like what's on the front there, you can't really see any of the clips with them black pipes of the clamps. And with the clamps, you can only really roll them up one way. Because if you roll them up the wrong way around, it can be hard to get them unraveled and get them down right. But you can just see it, I don't know, can you see it there, but the twists are just starting to roll their way out of that pipe at the end. You might be able to see it there flicking over. Now I know my windows are, aren't the cleanest, and that's just because we were splash this field and in splashing you get all that fine mist and it does destroy the windows of the tractor absolutely destroy them so no it's actually rolling up 100 percent so it's very straightforward just try and get it nice and neatly now one thing with our old system um no i don't have any pictures of it but you can see on the reeler there you can see the orange panel at the end of the reeler on our old system there wasn't any cover like that it was just the spokes and if you didn't get it rolled up nice and level and neatly if it puckered out if you any if you did it wrong and you got a pucker of pipe puckered out of it you'd end up on a hole in the pipe as it would start rubbing off the frame of the reeler and i used to be in awful trouble all all them black pipes in the front they're all old pipes now they're before my time but um every one of them has holes in them and are patched from from that happening to previous drivers we've had just just it was hard it was hard done like just to get it right so it was but um that's that's that and also with um these uh, new type or as we call them new type uh, fit ends uh, or whatever you call i can't think of the name of them but with them you can roll up pipes together you can roll them clamped together with the bower clips well, I think some people do, but we never, or the clamp, the clamp uh, fittings, 
we'd never roll them together. We always have ropes on every end of the pipe for tying them off and whatnot. And we just tie the two ropes together and sort of roll it up, roll the two ends up slack and then roll the rest of it up not to put that immense pressure on the pipe or that big bulge where that would be sticking out of. That was something we always did when we were rolling up but that's really it. It's fairly straightforward like when you're coming towards the end you can see the pipe doesn't roll up that nicely. It's just there's no, no real way in it to keep a, keep a pull on it. Something else I noticed um, if you blow out with the ball or a sponge or get a really good blowing out where there's like virtually no slurry in the pipe so you can find that that happens a lot sooner or sometimes all the time it, it just does not roll up okay at all at all at all um, I think it's just the lack of slurry in the pipe doesn't leave it with that much weight and it just doesn't roll up that nice and neatly so I have another I have another 200 200 about 550 meters of pipe and three more pipes to roll up I might be able to roll up two of them together. I'll see how it goes. My plan is now to put the camera that's on my head on the back of the reel and looking down on it. Hopefully it works. I we'll have to wait and see. Um, hopefully that works. Um, but I suppose that's really it. I'll pause it now and go do that.